I'm not sure whether you can see him or not, but right in the middle of the frame here is a red-bellied black snake. I'm just going to go in really closely. I can see he's, that's his head. Look, there he goes. Can you see him? Look. Can you see him? There he is. Look. See him just sliding over the rock? He's very, very slow. It's a very cold time of the year. But how cool is that? It is currently the 23rd of June. And what you're looking at is a very large red belly black snake. <laughs> it's not excessively large, but he's probably a good four foot long, I suppose. How cool was that? <laughs> that was so cool. That was a red belly black snake on the 23rd of June, the middle of winter. That is so awesome. That might shock some people to see a snake in winter, but it's actually not uncommon. You see, there's a bit of a common misbelief here in Australia that our snakes hibernate. They don't. Mammals hibernate like bears and stuff. Rodents might hibernate. Reptiles brumate. It's very similar. Brumation is similar to hibernation, but brumation is something that reptiles, like snakes do, when they get cold, they just go to sleep. They become lethargic. So he might have been asleep for the last three or four weeks, but today he's thought, there's just a little bit of extra warmth in the sun, I'll go back out. And snakes will do that all winter. He'll probably come out again in the next few days. When conditions are favourable, they'll come out of their brumation, just soak up a little bit of warmth, and then they'll go back in and go to sleep again until conditions sustain a warm temperature. Brumation versus hibernation. Mammals hibernate, reptiles brumate. He has probably been brumating, but as soon as that sun just gets enough warmth to warrant getting out of bed, they'll stick their head out from under their rock. We don't see many in winter. That's why people get this belief that snakes don't come out in winter. But the reason we don't see many is because when they come out, they usually don't travel too far. He might be brumating underneath that rock. There's a word for it, it's like a hyper column, a um, hyper, hyper column or something they call it, I'm not sure. That's the place where they hide, the hibernate or brewmate. He's probably brewmating right there and amongst them rocks, but when the conditions just hit that, that trigger point, he'll just come out the front door, lay close to the front door, and absorb the heat, but we don't see them because they're so close to their holes. In the springtime, when, they, when it's the warm weather is more regular, they'll come out and they'll travel across land, they'll look for breeding partners, and that's when we see so many more snakes. Brumation, not hibernation. Google them, you'll be fascinated. That was a snake, it's the 23rd of June. That's awesome. <laughs>